Hey everyone, Jason here, and welcome back to The Layout. You know, nowadays we seem to be in the MTH era of custom runs, where every hobby shop is doing their own run or paint scheme of an MTH train item. Today, we're going to be looking at two such items that I recently picked up from Stockyard Express in Oberlin, Ohio. They are the MTH Premier Stroh's Beer 36-foot wood-sided reefer car and the MTH Rail King Republic Steel SW 1500 diesel switcher. They're colorful, unique, and available for purchase only from Stockyard Express, and we're gonna check both of them out right now on Jason's O-Gage Trains. For those of you who don't know, a Stockyard Express exclusive is any train item that was commissioned and designed exclusively to be sold by the train store Stockyard Express, located in Oberlin, Ohio. I've talked about Stockyard Express on my YouTube channel countless times over the years, and they're one of my absolute favorite train stores to visit. So let's start by looking at the Stroh's Beer Reefer. This is MTH item number 20-94538. Now, I'll be honest, I have no special connection with Stroh's Beer or its history other than it was a brewery in Detroit, Michigan, which is where I live now. It was actually several members of the Detroit Three Railers Train Club who put this reefer car on my radar, and after seeing the artwork, I decided to order one from Stockyard Express. In fact, I ordered four of them with the intention of keeping two and selling two. I ended up keeping one and immediately sold the other three to club members because they were so desirable. And looking at this car's colors and graphics, I think you can see why they were so popular. The Stroh's logo and lettering really pops with the gray background. And as we look around the car, we see a ton of separately applied details, such as door locks, hinges, grab irons, coupler cut bars, and brake wheel. It has sprung metal trucks, and the four ice hatches on the roof open up. Now, unfortunately, these sold out almost immediately from Stockyard Express. I don't know if they intend on doing another run, but that's how it is with these MTH custom runs. If you see something you like, you have to jump on it immediately, otherwise it'll sell out. Now let's look at the other Stockyard Express exclusive item I purchased, the MTH Rail King Republic Steel SW1500 switcher, and it is MTH item number 30-20841-1. You might be thinking, finally, Jason bought a colorful engine that isn't black and white Norfolk Southern. And I agree, it's refreshing to add a colorful locomotive to the layout finally. Now, unlike the Stroh's reefer, I do have strong ties to Republic Steel because not only am I in the steel industry, but my mother retired from Republic Steel after 38 years of service. I've added a lot of Republic Steel items over the years, and now I finally have an engine to pull them with. For a Rail King item, this engine actually has a fair amount of detail, especially on the rear side of the locomotive. Being such a small engine, it does not have a smoke unit. However, it is equipped with MTH DCS, Protosound 3.0, and two motors making this a surprisingly powerful engine. Now, I don't have a fancy measuring tool to calculate how many pounds of pulling power my locomotives have. I'm gonna be using a more practical test, which is these Atlas O intermodal well cars. These are all die cast and the containers are plastic, by far the heaviest freight cars in my collection. I usually have three to four Premier Line diesels pulling this train. So let's see if this little SW1500 switcher is up to the challenge. All right, little guy, don't let me down. Go, 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 go! Oh, it did a little burnout, but it's moving. Look at that, 20 scale miles an hour. That's surprising. Every one of these are die cast. All of them have two plastic containers in them. There's no one pushing this thing. It's doing this on its own. That's impressive. Okay, here it comes again. No trick photography. One engine, 25 scale miles an hour. It's doing it all on its own. Uh, 
That's really cool. <laughs> I gotta say, I know that my big Premier Line diesels could pull this train. They would struggle, but they could pull it. I did not think that a switcher that small would be pulling these so effortlessly. Okay, now that I've shown you that excessive demonstration of pulling power, let's run both of these items around the layout in their more natural environment. Well, that's going to just about do it for today's review. Stockyard Express actually has several custom run paint schemes available for the SW1500 Switcher. They have the Middle Steel Cleveland Works engine, also known as the Crow, Lima Hamilton Corporation, and Carline Brewing Company paint schemes, all of which are still available and for sale at Stockyard Express for $369.95. But as I mentioned, these custom runs sell out fast. So once they're gone, you'll be hard pressed to find them for sale again. So give Stockyard Express a call at 440-774-2131 or stop by their store in person located at 49293 Plate Road in Oberlin, Ohio, zip code 44074 and tell them that Jason from YouTube sent you. 
If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Ask questions in the comments and I'll do my best to answer. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. So let's see if this little SW... Check that out. I don't need the inspector to check that out.